finishing getting set up. I do hope everyone's having a good afternoon today. Staying warm. I know here where I'm at, it's only in the 30s. And I don't like cold weather. <laughs> Oh, let's see, where's my cords at? Okay, so where we left off, we just got Fergus out of the like the saw block so now we're working our way out of the actual prison grounds and we're getting ready to jump into this water and I don't know if we're gonna swim out or what but we shall see And if you're just coming in, welcome to Whoopool Gaming. If you're new to the channel and you like what you see, please hit that follow button. Make sure to enable all notifications, that way Twitch will let you know when I do go live. Uh, I, I'm i a more of a variety streamer. I had been playing a lot of Borderlands, and the only thing, I mean, I've beaten the storyline and working on doing the Platinum stuff, and I just needed a break from it. <laughs> So, we got this game on sell. Hey, Okami, thank you for that resub. How are you doing today, Okami? You're welcome, man. I'm good. Just have the regular job. Yeah, I was gonna ask you how that was going, cause uh, 
Yeah, I was like, man, you you were streaming yesterday, so I was like, oh, is he vacation time or just well, like Tuesday, like Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday? So my morning started off pretty nice. I mean, I woke up at six to start of your week is Tuesday. Tuesday through so you only yeah, that's not bad. You get four day weekends all the time. I went to go donate plasma this morning and found out that since I donated twice last week, they do this raffle deal every week where if you donate twice they put your name in for like they give away three ten dollar gift cards each week. And I ended up winning one of them. So, I won a $10 gift card to McDonald's, which was kind of nice, because McDonald's is only like two blocks away from the donation place. So me and my the person I rode with went and grabbed breakfast after we donated. And still have money left over. So we'll get breakfast again Friday morning. Oh, no, I didn't want to do that. There we go. So, anything exciting happening at work today, Okami? Alright guys, give me just one moment. I'm going to take the chat down off the side. Just cleaning out a unit that belonged to a crackhead. That's always fun. Oh yeah. Sorry for the blue screen, guys. Hey! Okami, thank you for gifting that sub to Artifice. Oh, that's awesome. I do appreciate that, and thank you. So, I watched this movie last night. Uh, Tucker and Dell versus Evil. Because Big Dog had told me to check it out, and a few other people had told me to watch it. So I ended up watching it last night, and I, I mean, I liked the characters that were in it, so, like Tyler Labine, or I think it's Labine, however you say his name, he played in a show called, uh, oh, Reaper, he played in Flyboys, the movie, and a couple other things, I mean, it, it was funny, I liked it. It was different. Jump damn it. Jump, damn it. I'm trying, I'm trying. I gotta remember how to do everything. Why can't I switch? Well, 
I don't know what to do. Oh, they will, man. I do appreciate it and don't feel bad. What, nine more days until we we get to play the new uh, the new uh, DLC, which I'm looking forward to. And then at the end of the month, they're going to retool the the raid so it a scale towards the number of people you have so you won't have to necessarily have a full group to play the only thing I wish I could do is climb Like, I'm so used to being able to, like, jump and, like, grab stuff. How is this possible? We're in the very center of Berlin. You're hiding in the plain sight. It's the last place they would look out. Will they not hear us? Best to keep your voice down, then, yeah? Fuck me. B.J. Blaskovich. I should have known only you would be dumb enough to do a daytime entry. The lady. Glad to have you back, friends. Caroline, you're alive. If you call shitting in a bag living, three pulverized vertebrae. You? Head trauma, four inches of cast iron shrapnel right in the conch. Still in there. Severed colon, septic shock, shattered pelvis. Memory loss, flashbacks, 14 years in a loony bin. Yeah. Good to see you, Wilhelm. So, what can you do? Pleased to see you too, Tekla. You're supposed to be dead, Burgess Reed. You've been gone for three months. This stupid anomaly. People don't come back from Eisenwald. And you, long since off the books. I've heard stories about you. I was told you died in 1946. This formation always. You, I don't even know who you are. We are variable. And none of this has been accounted for. I have to revise my whole model. Thank you very much. <laughs> I am hearing interesting things out of London. I have a folder marked Project Whisper, but someone has borrowed it. Klaus, I believe it was. Can you find it and bring it to me, would you please, Captain? Now that you are here, I think we can do great things. Why don't you sit with me, Miss Anya? Listen in on these frequencies. Anything out of London, make a note of the time and write down as much as you can. Here is pen and paper. Can I use your typewriter? You know how to type. Yes. My parents thought I should learn. Ah, for you to take dictation, prescriptions on such. Um, not really. It was useful during my time at the University of London for my doctorate in archaeology. Then hey, hey forgotten. Came, and I had to go back home. I was only 16. Well, doctor, please assist me in figuring out what these damn Nazis all right. 
You can find Klaus on the second floor. He should oh, have man. support for Project Whisper. It's a ton of reading. All right, Okami, we'll be here. Uh, the star resistance buried people of London has been quelled calm. Sources inside London after the August uprising, which had seemed like a turning point for the resistance fighters, the German tyrants unleashed their latest machine of oppression, a monstrous thing called the London Monitor. Eyewitnesses report described the fight as a massacre with the cobblestone streets drenched in the blood of the brave resistance fighters crushed or gunned down by the giant machine. German elite combat units then proceeded to move from the black or from block to block systematically taking out the last remnants of free fighters. Leave me alone, alright? I don't know you. I'm not looking to make friends. That's fine. I don't mean to talk to you either. Uh, 1945. Maybe I should have started on this side and worked my way that way. That's all right. The Red Army were forced to retreat last night from Moscow, engulfed by flames, following a week-long German bomb raid. The barrage of mortar fire heard throughout the night, and well, into early Thursday morning, seems to have obliterated what was left of the inner parts of the city. As of yet, there has been no word of the whereabouts of either Joseph Stalin or his high command. London, uh, June 21st, 1948. Finally, the British tyranny comes to an end. As if blessed by the sun, the German flag hung high this morning over Buckingham Palace to mark the end of the tyrannical monarchy which has plagued the English people for centuries. Field Marshal Duroff Feinenbaum yeah. uh, who led the British invasion cautioned the army resistance Ca cautioned that armed resistance is to be expected <coughs> excuse me I don't have a mute button on my mic. I do apologize. Usually I'd unplug it real fast. Hold that for the queen. Yeah. Uh, where was I? Uh, caution arms. But the majority of British old people will soon realize how they have been fooled by the British government's warmongering leaders. Follow the surrender. Following the surrender, the whole of the Commonwealth now falls under German rule and the remaining armies have been ordered to stand down. Thank you. Berlin, 1960, early morning, a small group of prisoners escaped from Eisenwald prison. The prisoners have been described by police as highly dangerous murderers, rapists, and degenerates. They advise the public to stay alert for people displaying deviant behavior and report anything that may help them track down these individuals. Special assault team launched on launched an attack on the last stronghold and the People's Liberation Army within hours the Republic of China surrendered. Unconditionally, experts commented that the Japanese government now have no choice but to give up their territorial claims. In Asia, sources close to the Field Marshal claimed that a plan is being put down or put or drawn being drawn up for both China and Japan, which will transition the two countries into Servant states with separate governments and military. These states will, of course, be supremely governed by the superior German Empire. Yeah, I can't. Well, I mean, it could have happened. <laughs> Moscow, December 12th. The cold Russian winter bites hard, but one could not tell looking at the rosy, smiling faces of the victorious, victorious German army and the liberated Russian people. The last battle against the Red Army took place in... I can't say that word. Ish... 
if it, it, yeah, I tried. Following their month-long campaign to seize the Russian capital, uh, a campaign which, after numerous setbacks and hundreds of civilian casualties, caused the Russian people to turn against their own army. With mighty, with nightly bomb raids by the German Air Force on the Red Army's military factories in the Ural region, it was merely a matter of time before the Russian forces would start to lose their morale. The murderous tyrant Joseph Stalin is yet to be found, but there are rumors circulating that he may have been assassinated by his own men. April 1947. It was a devastating defeat for the Red Army when the Green flag was or German flag was raised on the western side of the River Volga this morning. In a statement to the reporter on site, Field Marshal Friedrich Ritter, Ritter, yeah, said that the victory is not only thanks to our hardworking and dedicated troops, but also the result of a new weapon that was delayed or deployed for the first time in battle, the Panzerhund, is a mechanical, autonomous beast of war that cannot feel fear and cannot feel remorse. It is the purest form of killing machine, and it will tear the Russians apart limb by limb. Uh, June 25th, 1945, the Royal Air Force, Air Force bleh, suffered a major defeat yesterday at the Battle over Liverpool. Though major losses were reported on both sides, the RAF were forced to retreat after losing more than two-thirds of their fighters. But even when faced with overwhelming odds, our brave boys in the skies continue to fight for king and country. This fighting spirit may be what constitutes the very essence of Englishness. Us Englishmen, we fight until the very end, said a corner shop owner trying to put on a fire raging, put out a fire raging in St. Luke's church, and I'll be damned if I will let some Jerry come in here and tell us all what to do. Was this man channeling the spirit of a RAF pilot was this man channeling the spirit of RAF pilot Jameson, Jameson, who was shot down above Liverpool yesterday, burst out of his burning wreckage with his body on fire and armed only with a pistol, and killed four German paratroopers before finally succumbing himself. Even as the enemy stands at our doorstep, the RAF will go to hell and pack to kick them out of England. Jolly good boys. Vancouver in 1947 earlier this week a German submarine was sunk in the Cabot Strait just a few miles off the coast of Cape North today hundreds of ships crossed the Atlantic and the first German troops set foot upon or Canadian soil now is the time to be brave, said the Prime Minister in an emergency radio broadcast. It's now or never. Our boys at the front line need your support to defend our homeland, to defend our freedom. <laughs> but see, I've got... I'm trying to get... I want to... I should try to get through this game as quickly as possible, because I have, I have, uh, the new Colossus should be on hold for me at the library, and the new Blood should be on hold for me also, so... I'm pretty sure this is as far as I made it when I played it on PS3 before I stopped playing it. Mark, 
his room. I finished Star Wars so I need a new game but I want Pokemon but can't afford the Switch and the game. Well that's a bummer. See I had the Star Wars game but then I got this and this haven't really... This room looks empty. Maybe we could sleep in here. Could use some shot eye. Hey look, a health upgrade. Hey look, there's gold back there, but I can't get to it. Oh wait a minute, is there a secret passage? Yep. There's the record. Listen to it. Right. That's kind of where I'm at right now with. Just a damn enigma code. It's alright. When Die Koffer was formed by four Englishmen from Liverpool and Nazi controlled Great Britain, they were for or faced with a choice. Either start singing in German or face banning and detainment by the Nazi regime. Die Koffer chose to adapt to the times. They changed their name and learned how to sing in German. Currently, they're touring Europe to promote their latest Das, das Blue U-Boat album. Rumor has it they laced their innocuous pop music with hidden codes that subvert the original meaning of the lyrics. I wonder if that's supposed to be the Beatles. Oh joy, more reading. <laughs> yeah. Chang, Chang King, Japanese pushback and other threat approaches. Uh, March 7, 1948, it was a proud moment for the Republic of China and the People's Liberation Army as Japanese were pushed back into Hubei province yet from the north, another dark menace 
approaches at a swift pace. The German army has overthrown the brave Russian Empire and is now moving towards China. During a rousing speech earlier today, the chairman spoke of his faith in the Chinese people. A unified China cannot be defeated, he said. A unified China cannot be conquered. A unified China will never surrender. Day before Christmas. Come on. <laughs> Washington, December 24, 1948. Speaking to the American people in the falling snow on Christmas Eve, the President of the United States declared the government's total surrender to the German army. The announcement comes just days after the atomic bomb was dropped on New York. This final act of violence may have saved millions of lives that would have resulted from a land invasion of America, said the German leader in a press conference or in, in a press statement following the announcement. I applaud the president for taking such brave for taking such a brave decision. After the president's speech, a spectacular show was put on by the invading troops par parading down the streets of Washington to the roaring sound of German jet fighters passing by overhead. Even more spectacular were the massive mechanical beasts known as Panzer Hunden or armored dogs hulking over the crowds. Atomic bomb hits America, Paris. You know what I really want to know if I can go back is what a guy carrying around a football you know what I really want to know if I can go back is what with the guy carrying around a football just on the off chance Uh, explain, because I'm a little lost. <laughs> Maybe I'm just not thinking about it right. Uh, the largest bomb ever invented was dropped 13 hours ago on New York City, largely decimating Manhattan and killing over 200,000 people. It is an atomic bomb, said our great leader in a radio broadcast speech to the public, 20,000 times more powerful than the biggest bomb ever created before. But more than a bomb, this is a warning to the American people. America rises from the ashes. The American spirit rises in the shadow of the mushroom shaped cloud that was produced by Germany's evil atom bomb with the when it hit New York, cells of freedom fighters have assembled across the country and are taking up arms through targeted attacks on German VIPs and bombings of crucial military installations. The American resistance is making it very difficult for the invaders to remain in control. Reports claim that claim the German invaders have become so desperate they are shipping elite anti-rebel units from China to prevent the insurrection from spreading. Eyewitnesses, eyewitness accounts also describe mass executions of civilians as punishment for attacks performed by the freedom fighters. Alright, so in World War II they played soccer, so what was going through the guy's mind bringing a soccer ball just on the off chance have a quick match against the Germans. Oh, okay. All right. So, when did it happen exactly? Is it I feel like uh, I feel like I'm missing something. <laughs> Rome, October 13th, 1949. And so we must face the bitter truth. We, the Italian people, have been fooled into thinking that our northern ally would be our country's salvation and a collaborator in rebuilding Italy to its former glory. Reports from the north are coming in. 
describing German tanks and infantry turning against our soldiers and attacking our own people. Witnesses described the horror describe horrible scenes of whole villages burnt and plundered. We are now just days away from a complete invasion and our weak government is incapable of doing anything about it. I advise all Italians not to surrender. Do not bow down to the will of the invaders. Rise and take up arms. Do whatever you can to fight back the ty tyranny. Rise for freedom. Shanghai, October 25th, 1953. Benevolent Liberators Guard China's Borders. Thanks to the ingenuity of German engineers, the Great Wall of China has been reinforced and upgraded by our benevolent German Liberators. Hundreds of powerful automatic flak cannons have been installed along the wall, guarding the airspace from any potential invaders from the Mongolian territories. Uh, elite German troops have also been stationed on from one end to the other to guard the border. This is a great act of generosity bestowed by our benevolent liberators in, the, in making the beginning of a new era of peace in Asia. America loses naval supremacy. Tokyo, August 20th, 1946. The Americans are on their knees. Marshal Franz Gustav Byers told the gathered reporters during today's press conference the superior German submarine fleet, its loyal Japanese allies, has helped Germany achieve a major victory in the Pacific, with more than half of the American fleet destroyed at the Battle of October 13, 1960. A strange feeling of serenity comes over me as I walk my morning promenade along Unterden Linden. At first, I struggle to understand what this feeling comes from and why I haven't felt it for so long. And then it hits me for the last six months there has been no t terrorist activity. No ruthless killing sprees against innocent civilians, no car bombs in peaceful neighborhoods, no suicide attacks on public transports. Has the Soviet police once and for all won the war against ter terrorism? The famous First World War football match of the Christmas Day truce started after a ball was kicked from the British lines into the no man's... Oh, okay. mold infestation in Berlin. It's fair to say there's some sort of public or poetic justice in this. Reporters from our resistance friends in Berlin suggest that a new type of mold spore has started infesting structures made out of the super concrete used by the regime. It has started festering in the massive underground ventilation system and is spreading throughout the city. Friends of the resistance this could be a major advantage for us. The mold seems to corrode the stability of the concrete, making it easier to destroy structures that are important to the regime in Berlin. For a minute, so I can sleep, right? Uh, wake me if I say uh, the sky's about to fall or some such shite. Fuck it, just go away. <laughs>
That's funny. Never stops until I die. <laughs> this guy neat. Okay, all the doors do stay open. Oh no, it's um...
It's the escape from Castle Wolfenstein. I remember playing this game on the computer. I wonder if the guys that created the original Wolfenstein ever thought that graphics in a video game would get to where they are today. I just wish I had a map. Cause I... Right. Yeah, I was about to say there's gotta be a damn dog here somewhere. Why is this room here unless there's a secret? Hey, I can actually hit something. Either I'm missing something or there was nothing in there.
Back in the day, the graphics look amazing. And look at them now. Right. Right. I swore there was something I had to do. I thought there was something I had to do where I had to get kills while leaning, but... Probably save this ammo because who knows what's coming next. I like the look of the old school Lugers too. Okay, 
Horse Dual Wield. Kills while sprint sliding. See, I'm no good at doing the sprint. Yeah, see, I shouldn't have tried that. Especially not knowing who else was in the room. I did get it. My bad. Any food or armor? Okay, no more being silly. <laughs> <laughs> the music's kind of cool. I wish I would have found more ammo for that, though. Sorry about the blue screen guys, I just want to see what that is. <laughs> Unlock stealth perk number eight. Reduces the sounds made while sprinting, increases movement speed while crouching. I feel like I'm missing something.
Really? That was it? Why can't I use my... I really need you to step aside. Max, bitte. Geht zur Zeite. Das er ist wichtig. Max, komm her. Komm an. Alles in Ordnung. Alles wird gut sein. Sorry. I should have known you would have taken it. I don't know what happened to Max. See, there's a way over there. There's the Thing, but I don't have the tool that will let me Hey Doodles, how are you? I'm doing good. Can't really complain. I've had a pretty good day. Like I was saying at the beginning of the stream, I ended up uh, winning a $10 gift card to McDonald's this morning because I donate plasma. And since I donated twice last week, I donate twice every week, but since I donated twice, I got put into a drawing for a... Uh, one of three gift cards and I just happened to win one so it's like hey sweet so <laughs> I was able to buy breakfast this morning after I got done donating
<laughs> right. Bro, work is what's going on, Okami? Bobby Bram. Bobby Bram used to be the owner of a bake shop in southeast London. During the blitz, the baker's shop was hit by a German bomb, but fortunately Bobby was out on an errand that day. The next week, Bobby was drafted into the army. He kissed his wife goodbye and was shipped out to the continent. Shipped out to the continent. Years later, he would visit her grave in Nazi-occupied London. The only thing that has kept him from falling apart during the dark post-war years has been the work he's done for the Chrysler Circle. This busy as fuck. I know where the gold is, I just can't get to it. Thank you. <laughs> the map does me no good. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wow, really? I need that poster. Gonna look at it. Alright, you're fine, duels. Oh, the. That poster of the, the wartime girl. Good luck in your DVD game. A lot of neat posters in this game. Yeah, I've been playing for what, an hour, hour and a half, and I haven't really done anything because I've been. I did shoot a few Nazis in the Nightmare game. But mainly, I've been looking at pictures and stuff. Yeah, see, I, I don't think I made it much further in this on the PS3 version. Huh, I wonder what that's a map of.
Man, there's nothing else here. Oh, you're fine, man. I'm trying to figure out what this is a map of. I mean, it could be nothing. Hey, hey, forgotten. Thank you for gifting that sub to Doodles. I do appreciate it. Right. I need to figure out something else to do with it. Alright, let me write this down real quick so I don't forget. Sorry guys, I'm just rerunning through my chat real quick, see if check something real quick. So, Kami, what are your plans for tonight? I heard you were looking for the Project Whisper folder. It's not here, <laughs> obviously. Much obliged, Captain Vaskovich. I'm ready for an assignment. Okay. Thanks, old comrades. 
Well, if you this stream, I'll, I'll stop in. Object Visible. It's been in development for years. A helicopter aircraft. So Nazis have found a way to make it virtually silent in flight or undetectable by means of radar. Anya has decrypted the Nazi chatter out of London and located the only three prototypes in existence at the London Nautica Research Facility there. The Captain Blasco chose the team. We are finally strong enough to strike at the operations. The days of scurrying like rats are over. With these machines in our possession, we can go anywhere, hit anything. We will rebuild the Kreisau Circle, arm ourselves All right, we'll to the head. No worries. We will rise up and take down death head for good. They think the war is over. The we are weak, beaten, don't have the guts to oppose them. And as always, they are wrong. I've got a 14 hour drive. I've got a sinus infection. I haven't had a full night's sleep in eight months. So let's go, people. Because I'm not doing this again. You've got balls of steel, Bobby Brown. Stop. I just want to get this over with. Gandhi! Get ready! Hands on! Keep a feel of it. Thank you. It's a good idea. Arita! Arita. This big fucking disgraceful building is a London Nautica. This used to be downtown London. Used to be fighting in the streets over here. I mean, furious, unrelenting resistance. And then the Nazis brought in the London Monitor and everything went to shit from there. They just do whatsoever they please now. They just fucking leveled everything and he went to this fucking monstrosity. It's a top Nazi research facility, this is. Aviation, space, all kinds of evil shit transpiring. Caroline and the other pilots should be over the radio tower by now, you see it. Anya's operating the radio back in Berlin. You can reach him using this. This is where you get off. So long, Blaskowitz. You make this count, all right? Alright guys, give me just one moment please. I do apologize for the blue scream. Okay. Alright guys, I'm gonna take a real quick like two, three minute break or so. Just so I can get up and walk around and stretch and whatnot. Um But I will be back in just a few moments. Feel free to chat amongst yourselves in the chat. I'll get caught back up as soon as I come back. I just gotta get up and stretch for a few moments. But um Alright, I'll be back in just a few moments, guys.
sorry about that guys I took a little bit longer than I said I would but I was talking to uh, my roommate's daughter and her husband and got to see the baby he's crawling now Okay, let's get the chat down off the side of the screen. We'll get back to the game. I do apologize for that blue screen, guys. Okay. How do I have the map for here already? See, I remember this part too, but I didn't, I didn't think I played this far into it on the PS3. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's nothing out here, but I want to make sure. I guess I could check this. There is quite a bit. At least there's no letters, just all Enigma codes, goal, concept art, which you find just by doing the level. That scared the piss out of me. Looks like I'm going a different way, guys. What the hell? Do I have to run and slide? I'm going this way. That's right.
I thought about talking to Doodle about possibly doing a Borderlands type emote. So this guy's right over here on the other side. Shit. Oh, we're restarting from the last checkpoint. Hopefully it's just, yeah. It already be through all that. Oh. Is that a bad guy? Must be on the other side.
Uh, Dorset, affectionately known as Jurassic Coast, has been the focus of the scientific world community for the last month when the, the fossil of a new species of marine reptiles <coughs> was uncovered. Paleontologist Helmut Lehmann Lehmann has been trying to find a way to recreate extinct animals for a suggested prehistoric zoo. These last findings could be just what we've been looking for said the professor when we met him at a local cafe this week and if we can harness these animals correctly they may be beneficial to our military too. dinosaurs instead of tanks we'll just have to wait and see I have a feeling these numbers have something to do with the... It had Jurassic Park reference. The Enigma codes, but I'm not sure. Whoa. There are grenades, goddammit. Alright guys, well, I just realized what time it was. We are going to raid Team Pawnage Live, because Hobo is doing the TPWA stuff right now, I believe. And I usually watch that, so... Um, guys, thanks for coming by and hanging out. I do appreciate it. Uh, maybe we'll jump back on for a little bit after the TPWA is over. Um, and play for a little bit because it won't be that late when it goes off um, but I want to do a quick shout out to Roll Kick Okami, thank you for the resub and gifting Artifice the sub um, and Forgotten yeah, your debut I want to make sure I watch it too uh, <laughs> Forgotten, thank you for gifting that sub to Doodles, I do appreciate it um like I said, I might jump back on for a little bit tonight after 
the TPWA so or TPWA stream because um, I hate to just I was getting into that level so I hate to just leave it right there but um, guys thanks for hanging out uh, I'll try to get back on for a little bit no promises though but with that being said we're gonna get this raid going and I will talk to you guys later